everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude here and I'm here to bring you my Spongebob episode review for Selling Out. Requested by Dark Mike 96 So Selling Out is about when this rich man named Howard Blandy tells Mr. Krabs to take an early retirement and offers him a ton of money to retire so that they could turn the Krusty Krab into another restaurant chain. Mr. Krabs, he decides to go ahead and take his retirement because of course, he just wants the money. But Mr. Krabs realizes that retirement isn't really as exciting as he was hoping it would be. So then he sees that the Krusty Krab is now Krabby O' Mondays. Mr. Krabs is working at the Krabby O' Mondays, but he's noticing suspicious things going on, including this manager who goes by Carl. So in my opinion, I actually thought Selling Out was a very well done episode of Spongebob. It was a simple concept, but I did like the idea of Mr. Krabs going into early retirement, but he realizes that retirement isn't so great. It's a really nice episode in my opinion because Mr. Krabs does show that he actually does care for the Krusty Krab and he cares about Spongebob and Squidward. He wasn't really showing that it was me, me, me. He was in the beginning, but when it gets to the ending, he actually shows that he cares and I thought that was really nice. The episode has a really good storyline to it. I thought the writers did a really good job writing the episode. There's plenty of humor to go along with the episode, such as when Mr. Krabs is in his early retirement and he says, wait a minute, I hate golf. Or like when Squidward is asked to sing happy birthday to his little boy, but Squidward's just singing all depressingly going, happy, happy birthday. <sighs> happy, happy birthday. So there were funny moments along the way, but I also did like how this episode goes into a little surprise twist. Like the Krabby Patties aren't actually what the Krabby Patties should be. It's full of trash. Like it's actually shocking that the writers actually went that route. That was something I totally didn't expect. Like you knew something suspicious was happening because Carl the manager is suspicious as hell. If you were working for that dude, if he was your manager, you would know from scene one that he's up to something. You saw in this guy and the way he acts too. He's a creepy character. He's not a normal fish and you kind of question how is he even like that. But I did like this twist that the episode went because it was something I wasn't expecting. And that's a huge credit to the writers for actually going a little bit bold with that twist. It was just very interesting what the writers came up with for the episode selling out and how it was executed was actually pretty damn clever. Now, my only problems with selling out is that in the beginning of this episode, Mr. Krabs does sing that cha-ching song, which, you know, it's okay. It's definitely not Spongebob's best musical number. There's a ton of musical numbers that Spongebob has had that is extremely catchy, a ton of them. But Cha-Ching, unfortunately, it really is not the best musical number because it just feels rather repetitive. It just felt like it was thrown in there for really no reason. But luckily, it was short, so it doesn't really take me out of the episode all that much. But yeah, at least the writers had the decency to keep it very short and sweet. I also didn't like how Pearl treated Mr. Krabs in the episode. He actually attempted to try to want to spend time with Pearl. But all Pearl does, she actually pushes her own father out of the house. She literally kicks him out. A daughter is not supposed to kick her own father out of the house. I thought it was messed up. I hated Pearl for that and I just didn't like that. And the last flaw I did have with the episode was how obvious Carl was. Like even when you first meet him, you're all like... This guy is up to something. And then when Mr. Krab starts working at Krabby on Mondays, you're all like, okay, yeah, this guy is definitely up to something. Like, the episode makes it so obvious. The character makes it really obvious. I wish the episode just kept it more hidden. Like, 
He'll be one of those characters that look like he's a nice guy, but on the inside, he has a different side of him. I wish the episode went that route instead of going obvious. Overall, though, I thought Selling Out was a very well done episode. I really liked it. Mr. Krabs was likable in this episode, and I appreciated that the writers actually showed that Mr. Krabs isn't always selfish. Okay, most of the time he is, but... Not always. I thought that was a nice touch for the episode. So I'm going to give Selling Out an 8 out of 10. So everyone, in the comments down below, let me know what did you think of Selling Out. This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power.